So one of the big races we're watching this election, a battle for the state's top legal office. Tonight we're going in depth with a closer look at both candidates hoping to be elected as the next attorney general. Democrat Chris Mays worked in former Governor Janet Napolitano's administration and served on the Arizona Corporation Commission for seven years. Then in 2019, the longtime Republican switched parties and is now running for the Arizona Attorney General's office as a Democrat. ABC 15 Justin Pizarra sat down with the Arizona native to discuss her campaign's journey and why she plans to put politics at the doorstep. I sat down with Chris Mays in her home in central Phoenix. Pictures of her and her now nine-year-old daughter are all around. So are campaign signs. She started her campaign 16 months ago, and the issues then versus now are quite different. What were you going to run on? What, what did you think was going to be like, this is going to be it? I, th I, I knew that, that, that protecting democracy would be a big part of it, but I, but I also you know, imagined that we would be talking a little bit more about the core mission of this office. One glaring and controversial issue now is abortion. My view is that all three of the anti-abortion laws that we have in the state of Arizona, including the 1864 abortion ban that would allow prosecutors to put doctors, nurses, and pharmacists in prison are unconstitutional. May says if she is AG, she will not prosecute any doctor, woman, or friend who helps provide abortion care for a woman. Mays is pro-choice and openly gay, and she used to be a Republican, but she switched to the Democratic Party several years ago. It makes my, my heart uh, heavy when I see my former party go down this road. Um, it's not the party um, of John McCain anymore. May says one issue that has plagued the party lies about stolen or compromised elections. It is terrible that, that, a, that, a, that a portion of the Republican Party has been, um, has been convinced by basically one man in this country, Donald Trump, that our elections are not uh, secure. That is wrong, um, and, and I'll fight it with every fiber in my being when I'm attorney general. May says she'd also push the Biden administration hard to make changes at the border. I want to be clear. I believe there is a surge uh, happening. We've got a problem. Um, and I don't believe the federal government has done a good enough job handling the situation. Mays is not just critical about her opponent, but also current AG Mark Burnovich. When I enter the office in January, I will put politics at the doorstep, um, and we're going to get back to prosecuting consumer fraud, prosecuting elder abuse, going after the fentanyl crisis in our state and protecting our water supplies. In Phoenix, Justin Pizarra, ABC 15, Arizona.